morning is pretty slow and quiet. I eat breakfast, then coffee. Sometimes I stretch, sometimes I just check on the plan and what's on the training. I never needed any external forces to motivate me. You need to really wish to be the best. Every single training I think about my goal. So it's this year's Olympic Games. I try to visualize it, how it will feel when I will compete on the big stage. My training is 95% of training just on the wall. I don't do any fitness, I don't go to the gym, I don't do any cardio. The other 5% is uh, my work with physio. I think climbing teaches you for life. How do you react if things don't go according to plan? Whenever is the preparation period, you never know what others are doing. Am I doing enough? Am I training hard enough? So it's always some doubts, some negative thoughts. So for me, it's important to have a person who is there for you. So in my case, means my coach. Me and my coach have a really good connection. And I have that luck that I can call my coach a friend. You can tell if anything is bothering you and he will understand you. The best part of bouldering is probably that every single training or competition, you get something new. There's no single move that it will be the same as the previous one. When I visualize Paris, I usually just try to place myself on the mats. I try to hear the crowd, hear the music, and just be present. And then everything comes along.